God's kingdom is like a man going off on an extended trip. He called his servants together and delegated responsibilities. He gave five talents. To one he gave two talents. To a third he gave one talent. Depending on the servant's abilities. Then he left. Right off, the first servant went right to work and doubled his master's investment. The second servant did the same. But the third servant put the single talent in a bag and then he buried it. After some time, the master of those three servants came back and settled up with them. The one given five talents showed him how he had doubled his investment. The servant given two talents also showed how he had doubled his master's investment. Good. The servant given one talent said, Master, I know you have high standards and you hate it when people are careless and you demand the best and make no allowances for error. I was afraid I might disappoint you, so I found a good hiding place and secured your money. Here it is, safe and sound, down to the last cent. Master was furious. That's a terrible way to live. It's criminal to live cautiously like that. If you knew I was after the best, why did you do less than the least? The least you could have done would have been to invest the sum with the bankers, where at least I would have gotten a little interest. Take that one talent and give it to the one who risked the most. And get rid of this play it safe who won't go out on a limb. Throw him into utter darkness. I actually do have six children here. Have you ever seen those old ones? Go down.
We have um, eight, five, four, eight.